Morning, Roy here. Quick video today up on the roof again, and um, I need to sort out the eaves support on this roof. So you would have seen in previous videos where I've re uh, fit a new membrane along here, fixed the leak, uh, fixed the leak here in the past, and all along here uh, the eaves protector has been installed incorrectly. Eaves protector, eaves support, eaves tray, whatever it's called. Um, so I need to whip off probably a row or two of tiles, maybe see if I can slide them up. Access the eaves protector and then uh, I'll show you what I need to do once I've got the tiles off. off I think So you can see here uh, where I fixed the leak on this bit of the roof. Uh, I ran the membrane over the top of this plastic eaves protector. And here you can see all the way along it's on top of the membrane. So if you had any water get behind the tiles it should run over the membrane down into the gutter in a way and not cause a problem. Here you could have water running over the membrane under the eaves protector and then trap water underneath that which will in turn rot your roof membrane. So what I need to do quite simply is take this eaves protector off, put it underneath the membrane, screw it down or nail it down and then just put the membrane on top of the eaves protector. Very simple job, but could save also a water leak and roof internal damage in the future. So uh, yeah, let's get on with it. Well, that pretty much just fell off. So here, look. 
Look at this. If I hold the camera level, you can see the negative impact this eave support is having on top of the membrane. As you can see there, look, it's created a valley. And all the water and debris is getting trapped in here. With all this. You can see here it's like some sort of moisture damage. Random block of wood, lovely. Uh, membrane nailed here, shouldn't be really. Um, yeah. So you can clearly see what the eave support should be preventing. So it should look a bit more like this. There's a bit of debris here from where I recently fixed this bit of the roof, but there's nothing really being caught here. Let's see, it goes over the top of the plastic. Eave support, and the water runs straight off. Whereas here, you can see it's all getting caught. So I'm just gonna brush all this off and get all the rubbish off. Got a bucket of grime out, just swept off the membrane, cleaned up the gutter, good opportunity. Uh, that's also a great opportunity to check underneath the membrane. I've got a bit of debris under there, but all the timbers are in good shape. No rot or you know, obvious signs of water damage, which is always great. I'm just going to clean out a couple of bits of junk whilst I'm here, be rude not to. And then uh, we can get the eaves support back on. Uh, for some reason there were slugs everywhere under the eaves protector, look at them. We'll try and escape out of my bucket, no chance. the board fixing floorboard Okay, look, first one in, one nail there, one nail there. So it goes underneath, membrane on top. If any water gets behind, it comes down straight into the gutter. Beautiful. I was faffing a bit here because I thought it was lifting the neighbor's roof tile, but it's not, it's just, it's just the way it is. Neighborino's out with his lawnmower. Excuse the noise, but uh, I did start by screwing them in, but didn't really feel right. I did one up here. I wasn't really sure whether it should be screwed in down here or up here. I don't think it really matters. So, but I'm going to remove the screws and use roofing nails instead because, yeah, I think it needs to sit flat.
pretty simple job. Let's get some roof nails here. They're going straight into the fascia board. I don't know if that's the best place to do it. Might be better to uh, nail them into the rafters, like here. But uh, I wanted a nice, wanted it nice and tight against that fascia board. Stop insects and stuff going up underneath. So that looks cool. So now, just bring this membrane back over the top. And there she blows. There we go, all done. Tiles back on. Hopefully, this will be the last time I'm messing with this roof until we get a whole new roof, which is probably many years away, or very unlikely to happen. So, nice, short, easy one today. I'm Froy, thanks for watching. Please subscribe and comment down below. Cheerios.